Now, I'm going to teach you a trick. Oh yes, a very important question. What is a magnetic field? Okay, drop these boards and try to catch me without moving from your place. Wow, you could catch me. Okay, now let me go. Now try again to catch me. <laughs> you couldn't catch me. Now try again. Aw, you failed again. Hmm, that's cheating. You can't move from your place. That was the condition. So, you could catch me at arm's length. Now open both your arms and legs. Now let's draw a circle around them. Okay, this is the area in which if something is lying, you can catch. This is your field. Similarly, magnets can only attract things within a certain area and distance. Try to pick that nail up a distance from the magnet. See, it doesn't attract. Now go near the nail. See, the magnet can attract the nail. So attraction of a magnet is limited to certain boundaries. This is called the magnetic field of a magnet. Do you want to see the magnetic field of a magnet? Okay, take a magnet and put a piece of paper on this. Now sprinkle some iron filling on it. Aha! See some lines are appearing. These are called magnetic lines of force. They are guides which tell us which direction a compass would move. This helps us to understand how magnets would work with different things. Always remember, these lines of force start from the North Pole and end on the South Pole. So now, let's